Good afternoon, friends. Uh, welcome to the mid market update. Uh, today, been the first day of uh, the new week. Uh, we had a long weekend. Uh, so, today the market opened in the green about 80 odd points on the Sensex, uh, whereas the Nifty was up around 20 25 odd points. Uh, uh, reasons being uh, good closing of the overnight US indices, though, even though it was closed in the flattish mode, but the US markets have broken the psychological uh, Dow Jones is closed about 13,000 for the sixth consecutive day and S&P 500 is moving towards the 1600 to 1700 mark. Um, so coming back to the Asian indices, uh, Taiwan and Shanghai were up by almost 1%, uh, Hang Seng and Nikkei were flat. Uh, so that uh, prompted uh, the Indian market to open in the green. Now, the couple of stocks which are on the buyer's radar are Sipla, HDFC, Reliance. Uh, then there is Tata Motors uh, the, from the auto pack. Uh, even Maruti is up by nearly 1% after the, the management announced that they are going to start the production today at the Manesar plant uh, after the one month uh, off due to that violence which erupted uh, at the plant. Uh, now for the taking of the market, uh, there were sectors now which are contributing like IT, uh, Infosys is leading the pack which is up by nearly 3.5% after it won the case uh, of the US uh, visa fraud case against uh, Jay Palmer. So that has lifted the sentiments and Infosys is up by nearly 3.5%. Uh, so that has taken the other ID stocks like Info, uh, TCS and Wipro which is up by nearly 2% uh, and 1% respectively. Uh, coming back, uh, Reliance is uh, taking its upward mark in the journey after Reliance and BP have announced that they might sell gas to the Andhra based power projects. So, if this does go through, it's a big uh, optimism and achievement out there uh, which will uh, the, provide the gas to the uh, need based uh, power plants. Uh, on the uh, metals front, uh, there seems some selling out there. Uh, Hindalco is facing severe. Uh, kind of selling pressure consistently after it has uh, not been able to announce good results and so that has taken a big toll on the stock which is trading at 110 rupees. Uh, also on the mid cap front uh, we are seeing some mixed bag uh, like infrastructure stocks are again back in the limelight and the buyers radar. Uh, so that that is again doing good. Uh, coming back to the forex market, uh, it's rupee is trading against the dollar is 55.55 is almost there since a couple of uh, session, a couple of weeks. So nothing much movement out seen there too. Uh, friends, uh, this today, uh, this week is a truncated week. Now we had a holiday yesterday, so we need to watch out for other gl global macro factors uh, uh, because the market uh, will take cues either from the micro or the macro factors. Otherwise, because the result season have almost ended, so you might not see some uh, big ticket action. Uh, in any of the side in the market unless we get some uh, information either negative or positive from the global or from the uh, micro factor. Uh, friends that's about it um, and the news and the updates we have till uh, mid market we'll get back to you more in the post market. Have a happy trading. Thank you.